In this video, I want to share with you this 100k per month hybrid model. Basically, if you are an affiliate marketer, chances are you only promoting other people's product. That's what most affiliate marketers do. That's how we get started, right? By just simply promoting other people's product. But then what's special about this hybrid model is that you want to incorporate you yourself promoting other people's product. That's why it is called hybrid, right? Other people's product plus your own products. So this is how you can scale the 100k per month if you want to grow your business. So we have two offers here as you can see low ticket front end recurring and also high ticket back end if you want to scale to seven figures you really do need a high ticket back end products because for me personally i've been stuck with just like low ticket products for like years in my affiliate marketing business basically i'm promoting products like seven dollars twenty dollars twelve dollars seventeen dollars you know all that kind of like low ticket products now some of them they do have a value ladder they have a front end they have a back end so that increases the average cut value but still it's really hard for you to like pull off like really big thousand dollars a day and you need a lot of volume a lot of high sales volume to make up the numbers and next day tomorrow right you have to start to make your sales again to get a new income coming in because there's nothing recurring here so every single day you gotta make new sales you gotta make 20 50 100 sales right to keep up your income so that it's not feast and famine right ups and downs ups and downs so it got to the point where i just like thinking right do i have to like do this every single day for the rest of my life right do i have to like sell new products every single day and then sell it at a high volume to maintain that high volume it's just not practical so the solution to that is actually to sell high ticket right i'm talking about five thousand ten thousand thirty thousand dollars packages so from there your profit margin is really high especially if you're selling an info product it's like a courses or online courses online program group coaching mastermind right those kind of products it requires very low maintenance you basically don't need any upfront hard costs to maintain those kind of programs so basically just like a membership portal with your online courses and some weekly calls something like that and they'll give you really really high profit margin so let's just say if you're selling a package for five thousand dollars if you just make one sale you can make five thousand dollars in a single day and then how I actually build up this hybrid model is that not only I'm selling a high ticket back end products, I do add in a low ticket front end recurring. Now the reason why is because for my high ticket back end, I just don't want to work with anybody. You know, I've been having experience working with a lot of people, you know, a lot of them mostly they are beginners, right? People who are just getting started. And I don't find happiness and basically enjoyment with working with total beginners, right? People who still don't have a niche, people who still don't have a product. And it just spent a lot of my time, a lot of my resources to get them going. And a lot of them, they don't even have the drive and motivation, right? They do want to change their life. They do want to make them make some money, but then it's really hard for them to get the ground running to like actually start to like put out content, making YouTube videos, growing a community. It just too much for uh, beginners. Now, of course, there are other companies and organizations out there that are doing a great job of educating beginners, right? Getting them up and running, starting from scratch, starting from zero and making their first one thousand and making the first ten thousand dollars is really tough thing to do right because most of the thing is not just about strategy but most of their mindset right people their mindset is weak as an entrepreneur so that's why they are not getting success so while i do have the skills and while i do have the format and a system to help them to set up things to help them to start making money but it just drains a lot of my energy right because when we are helping them we're helping our clients right we're actually giving them a lot of our energy and resources channeling from us to them to basically support and empowering them and then i don't find any happiness working with beginners or total beginners so i decided like money is just not everything for me right i'm gonna make some happiness in my business because it's something that i'll do for years to come so i make a decision to like okay i'll just like target you know entrepreneurs or existing business owners or existing affiliate marketers who actually have a business they're already making money they have a niche they have a product they have a proven acquisition channel whether it is their own facebook group youtube email whatever they have a ways to get traffic they have a ways to make affiliate sales and they do have an existing business running so that way i can help them very easily to ask them change a few things right adding something and then they can scale their business maybe from 10k to 30k 50k 100k per month it's much more easier for me to help them to grow and scale compared to getting a beginners from zero to up and running to making 10k per month it's much more harder than that for me to get them results and also i don't find happiness in that so i prefer to working around with people who i enjoy working with and that i actually enjoy hanging around with them so once i have that in mind right so that's very important that i want you to think about your high ticket back-end products what kind of people do you want to work with right how much do you want to charge that actually worth your time in terms of the math and the profit margin it's actually just makes sense to you right you can actually hit the target of 
your goal. Say for example, if you wanna make a hundred thousand dollars per month, and if you are selling your package for five thousand dollars, right? You need to sell twenty units. Can you make twenty high ticket sales per month in order to hit your income goal? And then once you got the math going, right? You sort out the math, and then you sort out the price range that actually makes sense to you and is profitable to you, and actually hit your income goal. And you have to think about what kind of people do I wanna work with? Who is your dream client, right? What kind of things that you can actually help people to change and transform the results? Chances are you're already doing something. Maybe you're an expert in affiliate marketing. Maybe you're an expert in email marketing. Maybe you're an expert in funnel. Or maybe you're an expert in Facebook group, right? Maybe you're an expert in solo ads, right? Different things you might have some experience in that you can actually sell that information, sell that transformation in a high ticket backend, working with people who you love hanging out with, charging high prices that are worth your time. And then once you have the high ticket backend in mind, right? You gotta think about how do you drive traffic back to your high ticket funnel? So personally, I use YouTube, right? As my traffic engine, because once again, YouTube is a great organic traffic channel. And like I mentioned in one of my previous videos, they do have a compounding effect, right? On all the videos that you publish, it's getting stronger and stronger. Your brand, your channel, is keep on growing, getting stronger. You're reaching more people. And just give you that snowball effect, getting all the fresh traffic into your high ticket offers that you're selling. But then one thing, once again, get to this hybrid model is that once I have that in mind, right? The high ticket thing, I want to filter out the people who I want to work with and people who I don't want to work with. So I'm thinking like, how can I do that? How can I basically filter up, you know, all the people who are actually want something that I want while weeding out all the people who I don't want to work with which is not a good fit so I need some sort of filtering mechanism here so that's why community group is really important for you to build a tribe right build a followers who are actually interested in the framework that you're teaching right for example my framework hybrid model I talk about you know front end recurring high ticket back end I talk about YouTube I talk about community group so these are all the elements in my framework that I love to talk about and also I implement in my own business so this is like my own ecosystem that I want to talk about so I want to attract people who believe in this framework who believe in this ecosystem so I want them to get into the community group where I actually love hanging out with the group right because we're talking about the same thing it's like a mastermind going on and then I'll share with them my tips my strategy and so my numbers and how they can implement this framework right this framework they're talking about we're gonna teach them inside a community group as well and then once they buy into the community group and the framework it is very likely they will like want to extend you know like to just work with me at a closer level and a high ticket program so it just makes sense to have a community group with all the like-minded people with all your target prospect who you love working with and then within that 100% of people maybe just like 2% of the people they want to ascend to the next level so it's just logical for them to like reach out to you they want more access to you they need more implementation help they need more coaching from you so it's just a very logical next step so that's the reason why community group is really powerful but then personally I don't want to create a free group right basically that's going to ruin all the culture the environment of the group you're getting all the people coming in you're getting the bad apples and ruin the entire basket so I'm thinking right i need some sort of filtering mechanism again right while building my community group is that i don't want any freebie seekers coming in that's why i'm gonna put in a front end low ticket recurring product so by doing that i'm actually building my passive income stream as well because i love to like partner with one of the company right for example a SaaS product so in this case i'm partnering up with school right s-k-o-o-l as you can see here school is a software as a service product it's a SaaS product basically allow us to create community group like this that they call them as a school right this is my school community so basically this software as a service product actually ties into my framework right because i'm teaching this framework here youtube community and then recurring products so it just fits into my framework so if i put the front end recurring SaaS product that i'm promoting as an affiliate i'm making 40 percent commission right so i build up that passive income stream that's one thing and so second thing it acts as like a filter right because if people they subscribe to school meaning they buy into this framework that i'm teaching here right this hybrid model and then all the people who they don't subscribe to school they don't want to use school they don't want to build a community they don't like youtube they don't like high ticket right they're gonna filter out from my community so that acts like a layer of filtering and then all the people who subscribe to school right they buy into this framework they're gonna join the community group meaning they are already they are buy in right they like this framework they want to implement this framework so i'm going to share with them a lot of things within the community build up the community and then a small percentage of them will actually want to ascend to the higher ticket program so that's all the logic behind right you have to start at the back because all your decision making have to start at the end so you have to just think about right what kind of niche you're in so once again the best way to start is at the end you have to think about your high ticket back end right what do you want to sell who do you want to target and then you want to create a community group to basically gather around all the people who are your ideal prospect in a community so they can nurture them and then you want to set a filter of like who are able to join the community group who are like your ideal prospect as well so for me personally i partner up with a SaaS product that can make a front end recurring commission to build on my passive income and act like a filtering layer to get people into my community group and then getting them into my high ticket product and i feel this entire engine we 
with my YouTube organic traffic. So basically, I drive traffic from YouTube. I getting people right call to action, ask people to basically sign up on this uh, low ticket front end recurring, and then they join my community group. So from there, I nurture my community and also build a relationship with them. And some of them they ascend to my high ticket backend. And then one cool thing about this entire machine is that it has a network effect, right? Once you're getting more community group, right, with the like minded people who are coming into community, you can actually push your new YouTube videos using a community group. Now, say for example, this is my community, right? So when I publish a new YouTube videos, I'll do a post, right, inside my community group where basically I'm pushing my new YouTube videos. Now, when you do that, right, you can basically boost more views, right? Promote a new YouTube videos in a community group. You boost more views to your YouTube and it gives a signal to YouTube, like this is a good content because it get a lot of initial velocity so that YouTube can push your videos out there to a wider and colder audience to attract new viewers to the channel and then you get more new people going to the community group. And then it just has this flywheel effect going on. More views, more community members, and then more views again, more community members just feed off one another. And one cool thing about this is that basically it helps you to target the right people. Because when you think about this, right, YouTube is just getting data, it's just getting signal. So if you want to attract the right kind of people, your ideal prospect who want to buy your high ticket products, you're going to feed the algorithm with the right kind of person that you want on your channel and in your community. So once you set that filtering layer here, you're going to get all the qualified people into your community. And when you post a new video, all of these, right, your ideal prospect, they're going to watch the videos and then they're going to feed into the algorithm. And then YouTube is going to help you to find more like look alike audience that seems like your community group members. Can you see how that's going, right? It just have this positive feedback going on with this strategy. And so one thing I like about school is that once you make a post, right, if you're an admin, you're a group owner, when you make a post, you can actually flip on this switch. As you can see here, send email to all members and you can basically broadcast your post to your entire group members. For example, right now, this is one of my community. I have 300 members in there. So 300 people. So it acts like a second email broadcast that you have, right? You have an email autoresponder that you're using, but then with school, you can actually make a post and broadcast to your entire group members here. So it acts like a second layer of like attack that you can actually reach out to other people, right? Second layers of like, you know, reach to your audience. And on top of that, in my previous video, I do talk about that. It actually builds up the second, you know, safety net as well. Because sometimes, right, I see a lot of scary stories like YouTube that got shut down. So once your YouTube got shut down, guess what? They do have a community group. They do have an email list. And that acts like a safety net for you to like, you know, when your channel got shut down, your ad account got shut down, your, your Facebook group got shut down, you can actually send out an email or you can do a post in a community to ask people to subscribe to your new channel, to your new platform. So it just has so many advantages right now to have like, you know, a community group. Number one is that it just gathers all the like-minded people. You nurture them, right? Like a real world interaction with them because you get to post question, answer question. You can do like a weekly Q&A call with them. As you can see, all the calendars, you do have a weekly Q&A call and also classroom where you have all the training programs, like free courses, paid courses in there. They watch the course, they engage in the community and also they do join your weekly webinars, weekly uh, live Q&A, so on and so forth. And that all just build a very strong bond and relationship with them. And then a small percentage of them will actually ascend to a high ticket product. So this is the number one benefit of having a community group is that the conversion rate is really high, you know, with all your community members. And number two, it acts like a second layer of like reach to other people, right? Broadcast and then post because people are everywhere. They see you in a YouTube channel. They see you in your emails. They see you in a community group. You have an alternative way to reach out to all your fans, to all your audience. And then number three, it acts like a safety net for you as well. If something goes wrong, you're able to have another place where you can actually have all your audience gathered around like your own hub, like your own home where you get to set the rules yourself, right? You can decorate your groups. You can set the rules of your group. You can manage your groups however ways you want. And nobody's able to ban you from your own email list and your own community group. That's why I like both of that, right? Email list and community. So once again, this is how you can build your 100K per month hybrid model by using a high ticket backend, right? To give you higher profit margin and also a filtering layers of using a low ticket front end recurring, but that builds up your passive income as well. And both of them add up. You can make well over 100K per month, seven figures a year. And then having a consistent traffic engine and going on like YouTube fresh traffic, building your email list, building a community group, and then using your email list and community to like blast off, right? Promote your new YouTube videos back again to YouTube and feedback one off another, like a positive flywheel here going on. So if you actually like this framework that I'm talking about, if you like YouTube, if you like community group, if you like the idea of hybrid model where you can actually transition from just being an affiliate marketer of just like promoting other people's product, that you transition right into promoting your own products as well, plus some of other people's products just like a hybrid model. I'd like to invite you to join my new community here, which is called A Player. I just want A Player into this community group. Once again, I like to hang out with people who are like-minded with me. You're awesome people. You're amazing people. You already have an existing business. You're already making money, but you just want to implement this framework here using YouTube, using community 
community group to build up your business to scaling to 100k per month i want you to join my community so that we can hang out and i'll share with you a lot of my own strategy my numbers behind the scene on how i implement this framework in my own business so if you want to join this community group right now like i said i'm partnering up with school because that's the software that i use personally to build up my community so if you sign up for a free trial for school you're able to get access to my community as well called a player right not this community but another community called a player and that's why i give you a ton of really really cool bonuses that helps you to implement this framework here that we're talking about youtube community and this hybrid model here so once again watch this very closely because i'm just like you know i'm practicing what i preach here i do have my youtube right right now you're watching my youtube videos and then there's my traffic source and then i actually have a low ticket front end recurring which is cool basically i'm promoting and getting 40 percent commission and then i filter up to all the people who are qualified to join my community group a player and then if you want to ascend to my higher ticket program i do have something in the back end as well something like a mastermind going on so if you like this kind of framework this is everything we talk about inside the community group we don't talk about facebook we don't talk about solo ads we don't talk about low ticket front end we don't talk about instagram tiktok we just talk about youtube we just talk about community we just talk about high ticket and of course the low ticket front end recurring as well so this is the only thing that we're going to talk about in this community so if that resonates with you get into the community right sign up to school because that's going to be the tool that you will need anyways to build your community just like i did so once again check out the link in the video description below get started with your school trial and then i'll send you all the bonuses and get you into my a player community so if you still haven't watched my previous video where i talked to you about this big picture of this framework make sure you check out the next video and i watch that video on the screen click on that watch this video and you'll see me break down the entire framework here as you can see and i'll see you inside that video